Onan was the second child. He didn't want to do that. He didn't want to go into his brother's wife. Because he knew that that seed would be his. That was called the duty of a husband's brother. Hmm? So Genesis 38 and 7. Let's see what it says. Genesis 38 and 7. Genesis 38 and 7. And Ur, er, Judah's firstborn. And Ur, er, Judah's firstborn. Was wicked in the sight of the Lord. Was wicked in the sight of the Lord. And the Lord slew him. And the Lord slew Ur. Er. He killed him. Slew him. Read. And Judah said unto Onan. And Judah said unto Onan, Onan being his second child. Read. Go in unto thy brother's wife. See, look, go in. What do you think that means? Hmm? That's right. Go in unto thy brother's wife. And when you go into it, what's gonna happen? Read. And marry her. See that? That's the one he's gonna marry. Her. <laughs> That's right. Am I right? Mm -hmm. Is it right? Read that again. 38 and 7. Read. And Ur, uh -huh. Judah's firstborn. Er, Judah firstborn was wicked. In the sight of the Lord. Yeah. And the Lord slew him. And the Lord slew him. Read. And Judah said unto Onan. And Judah said unto Onan. Go in uh -huh. unto thy brother's wife. And do what? And marry her. See that? He had to go into it and marry her. Hmm? Well, he had to cleave unto her. Therefore should a man leave mother and father and cleave. Marry his wife. My God wants you to cleave, you have married. And once you have married, my God would God have joined together. Let no man put asunder. You bow as long as he or she shall live. But if she be dead, you loose from the law. You're able to go marry. But if you do it while they're alive, you shall be called an adulterer. Ain't that plain enough? Amen. Ain't you glad you some folks ain't tangled all up? <laughs> That's a rough thing. <laughs> be tangled with somebody. Woo! When you tangle, you better know who you tangling with. Amen. Am I right? Amen. See, preachers don't understand. They don't have it. I thought he got people all screwed up. See, that's why Jacob was upset. See, Jacob, he left and traveled toward the east and ran into his brother. And he saw Rachel. My God, he saw Rachel in the Bible said he looked up and saw Rachel. And then he kissed her the Bible said he weep, he wept, wailed. Well. <laughs> Bible said that Rachel, my God, he wanted her. But Rachel had an older sister named Leah. Laban had two daughters. One name was Leah, one name was Rachel. Leah was tender-eyed. You know, soft. But Rachel was beautiful and well-favored. Meaning what? You know, she was, not only was she beautiful, but she was cut. You see what I'm saying? Rachel was beautiful and cut. <laughs> 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 you follow what I'm saying? And Leah was just tender-eyed. You know, you know, you see some women they tender-eyed. That's a good, that's a nice lady there, nice young lady. But then you see some women they be beautiful and king, 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 king. <laughs> follow what I'm saying? You understand? You understand? All right. Well, let's get that uh, Genesis 29. And uh, I believe 16. Genesis 29 and 16. And Laban had two daughters. And Laban had two daughters. The name of the elder was Leah. The name of the elder was Leah. And the name of the younger was Rachel. And the name of the younger was Rachel. So he had two daughters. One named Leah. Father. Yep. 
He had two daughters. One named Leah and the other was named Rachel. My God, two daughters. Two of them. Not one, but two. They ever had two daughters. Read. Leah was tender-eyed. Oh, Leah was tender-eyed. Uh-huh. But Rachel was beautiful. Ooh, but Rachel was beautiful. And well-favored. And well-favored. <laughs> you know, <laughs> she was, yeah, she wasn't just had a pretty face. You follow? She was well-favored. Read on. And Jacob loved Rachel. And Jacob loved Rachel. And said, Uh-huh. I will serve thee seven years he, for Rachel. He told his uncle, I'll serve you, uncle. <laughs> Laban, Laban was his own. Because I served you for seven years for Rachel. <laughs> that sucked, man. He said, I serve, serve you for seven years. If I can have that. <laughs> I will serve thee seven years for Rachel, thy younger daughter. Uh -huh, read on. <laughs> and Laban said, uh -huh. It is better that I give her to thee. It's better I give her to thee, Jacob. Read on. Than that I should give her to another man. And I give it to someone else. At all, you know, you're my sister's son. Read. Abide with me. Abide with me. Read on. And Jacob served seven years for Rachel. Jacob served seven years for Rachel. Read on. And they seemed unto him for a few days. Ooh, see that man. For why I seemed for a few days? Read. For the love he had to her. Oh my, he served seven years, and seven years didn't seem like but a few days. That's some love there, ain't it? Mm -hmm. You served for seven years, and then but a few days? <laughs> my God, my God. Read on. And Jacob said unto Levin. And Jacob said unto Levin. Give me my wife. Give me my wife. My seven years up. <laughs> Give me my wife. Read. For my days are fulfilled. My days are fulfilled. That I may go in unto her. That I may what? That I may go in unto her. Come on now. People try to act so sophisticated these days. <laughs> Bottom line, a man marry a woman, what are you going to do? Go into her. He said, well, I'll marry for that reason. Yeah, right. <laughs> Let it not work. Let her tell you it don't work. Say, so, you know, mine don't work and it's stitched all up. Like, it ain't, ain't no hole nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> and let's see you go going down, down, down. Yeah, right. Hmm? It may happen after you get married, then you're bound. But you ain't going into no marriage that way. Not if you got your right mind. Unless you want some kind of game. Hmm? You want to be one with her. How you going to be one with her? Hmm? Read on. And Jacob said unto Laban. And Jacob said unto Laban. Give me my wife. Give me my wife. For my days are fulfilled. My days are fulfilled. That I may go in unto her. That I may go in unto her. Read. And Laban gathered together all the men of the place. He, he made a big old feast. Yeah. Why? His why? His daughter about to get married. And made a feast. Uh-huh. And it came to pass. And it came to pass. In the evening. In the evening. That he took Leah. Leah. He took his Leah. Daughter, now he supposed to get Jake. Jacob was supposed to get Rachel. But Laban is pulling a fast one on Jacob. He giving him Leah. <laughs> read on, read on. Read. And brought, him, brought her to him. And brought her to him. And he went in unto her. He went into the wrong one. <laughs> he went into the wrong one. Read. And Laban gave unto his daughters Unto his daughter Leah, uh -huh. Zilpah, uh -huh. his his maid, yeah. for it, and handmaid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Read. And it came to pass uh -huh. that in the morning. Now when Jacob arose, because see Laban done this thing in the dark. See, Jacob been waiting for seven years. <laughs> when seven years was up, he just was like a bull. <laughs> he, he didn't even check the merchandise. He went head on like a bull. Seven years up. Let me go into it. He went into the wrong one. <laughs> Read on. And it came to pass. Yeah. That in the morning. That in the morning. Behold. Behold. It was Leah. Hold on, man. I didn't marry Leah. <laughs> you see, he was stuck. 